Right, in this module, we're going to be teaching different ranges in boxing. There are four different ranges. And in this lesson, I'm going to be talking about the close range. So, Jordan. <laughs> My glamorous assistant. <laughs> Our stance sort of changes up a little bit. Instead of being so side on, we're going to square up a little bit more like so. And then we're going to have our defense a lot more tucked up and tight. So our elbows are going to be closer and our gloves are going to be closer. So when we're in the cl in close range like this, we're going to be throwing a lot of shots like uppercuts, short hooks, hooks to the body. And we're going to be dipping under a lot of shots too. We're going to change the angle of our wrist. So say we're throwing a normal hook, our palm will be facing the floor like so. But when we're close range, our palms can be facing us because that allows us to get a tighter, much quicker hook by having our palm facing us like so. So when we're on the inside, we want to be nice and tucked up, a little bit more squared up stance, be dipping under a lot of shots, good head movement. And we want to have our palm facing us when we're throwing hooks. The reason why we want such good defenses is because we're in the danger zone when we're close range. We, don't, we can't rely on our feet. We need to rely on our hand defenses and our head movement. So nice, tight, squared up stance, good head movement, nice, tight shots, bringing our hands back to our head at all times.